Meanwhile, a group of kids who were earmarked in grade school to be the next great class for Cathedral Athletics. They've already won a state championship in football this year. Today, they try to sweep Smithville for a state title on the diamond at Trustmark Park. The green wave of Natchez Cathedral taking on Smithville first inning. Andrew Beasley drags one down the first baseline off the glove of Kyle No and hits the Jets to cruise into second. Beasley then goes for the steal to third, and the throw goes right through the wickets of Chris Lockhart. Right there, 1 0 wave. Beasley on base percentage of 875, scored five runs and had two RBIs in the series. Third inning, though, Micah McCain says, My friends, I've got this. Rocket to left, past the outstretched glove of the Cathedral defense. We are tied at one apiece. Bottom half of the third, Quinton Logan up for the wave, and he slices this one just perfectly. The shallow left. That'll score Andrew Beasley. That gives Cathedral a 2 1 lead. Here's your ball game. Next batter, Pat Pate Shirley, rather, grounds it short. The Knolls flip it to second for the force to end the inning. Or do they? Smithville drops the ball, they jog off, but that was only the second out. So Cathedral scores on the mishap, makes it three to one, and they carry that momentum into the next batter. Two outs, Brock Farmer belts one to center, and then Shirley hustles to third, slides, throw, not even close. Shirley scores, makes it 4-1 for Natchez Cathedral. The Green Wave go to their bullpen in the sixth inning, and Sam Parker tosses two shutout innings to give Cathedral their first title on the diamond since 2004, 4-2. Winners, you can talk. It feels great, man. We, we worked hard all summer and all winter and came out here and got the job done. We've been playing together a long time. Since we were eight years old, we've been playing together. We know each other real well and play as a team, which is most important. We set the goal to get back here, and we made it. And these kids worked hard. Uh, Gabe Smith and Sam Parker did a great job on the mound today, and it's just a great feeling to be able to bring a championship home.